New at 6, Austin police have fired the officer linked to a high-profile killing after he fled the country. Chief Art Acevedo says Von Trey Clark is likely in West Jakarta, Indonesia, disobeying direct orders to stay in the U.S. to cooperate with investigators. This new development comes after investigators linked Clark to the case surrounding Samantha Dean's death. The local victim services counselor was shot to death in February. She was seven months pregnant at the time. KXAN investigator Robert Maxwell has been on this for months. And Robert, why did not authorities pull Clark's passport? That was an obvious question. Came up at the news conference as well. Chief Acevedo couldn't answer it. It's not his case. So we put it to the Bastrop County District Attorney. And Brian Gertz wouldn't tell us why today. Typically, though, a prosecutor will not pull somebody's passport unless that person is indicted or charged with a crime. We do know leaving the country without proper permission is part of the reason for his firing from Austin police. This after APD put Clark on administrative leave the day after Dean's murder. Now, we know investigators were watching Clark, and he was in Austin as recently as May 12th when they searched his house and car. He was at home then, we hear. Today, Chief Acevedo pulled no punches inviting Clark back to Texas to face justice. If you have any dignity, if you have any semblance of humanity left in you, Mr. Clark, get back on that plane and come back here to Austin. If you're innocent, prove it. Come over here and face the music. Now, Chief Acevedo suggested with Clark overseas, now federal criminal investigators will get further involved. We've been reporting that the FBI has had some involvement in the criminal side of the investigation. But back to Chief Acevedo for a second. He's spoken with Samantha Dean's parents and told him his number one priority is to make sure, at least to assist in helping bring those to justice who are responsible for this. All right, Robert, thank you. And as we mentioned, Austin's police chief says former officer Clark left the country six days ago. Police say Clark took a flight from Dallas-Fort Worth Airport to Tokyo to West Jakarta, Indonesia. That country does not have an extradition treaty with the U.S. That means officials in Indonesia are not required to send fugitives back to the United States. But the U.S. does have extradition treaties with more than 100 countries. All of the ones you see here in blue have treaties with the U.S. That's more than half of the countries in the world. And remember, for the latest developments on this story, stay with KXAN. We've been digging since the news broke this afternoon and the eventual the death of Samantha Dean back in February. And you can see a timeline with all of those developments right now at our website, kxan.com.